what's up everyone? Glock9 here and welcome to the final episode of Nightmare 2. It is the morning of day 7000 and we are headed to Trader Hughes to take on another tier 5 job. I don't know if we're going to be able to get it done before... Oh, god damn it. Stupid fucking ramp. Of course, the last day. Son of a bitch. You know what? Fuck this fucking ramp. Oh yeah, this ramp is like a Price is Right contestant, because it's coming on down. Fuck you. Oh, shit. Almost got killed there. <laughs> Imagine if we would have got killed by the ramp, and then just it. That was it. That was the end of the episode. All right. Uh, we're going to have to get home a little earlier, because we obviously can't use the ramp to get back up to our house tonight. Uh, so I don't know if we're going to have enough time to finish a tier 5 job, but we're sure as hell going to try. What's up, you? That's right. Arguably the largest one. But I'm not worried. You know why? Because the zombies, just like most guys, they don't know how to handle the G-spot. Some of them don't even know where it is. They think it's a myth. Isn't that funny? I'll see you later, you. Probably not, though, because this is uh, the last episode. Well, saved one of the best for last, I guess. The Shotgun Messiah HQ. Dude, there's no way I'm gonna be able to do a fetch and clear at this place before we gotta head home, but we're gonna fucking try. This is gonna be nutty. I know I got a couple zombies here. Dead. Oh. Dead. I think the better move, though, is to just run through this place and go right for the supplies. Grab those, and then try and get all the zombies killed. I don't know if that's the best strategy, but that's the one I'm going with. I'll keep an eye on the uh, supplies on the compass. Right now it's above us, so I'm just going to keep working my way up. Now here's a problem with speedrunning a giant POI like this. Eventually... Enough zombies wake up and and are running around that they stop spawning in. I don't know how that's going to affect the the clear the area part of this job, but we're gonna find out. Fuck you. All right. Oh shit. See, yeah, there are no zombies here. They're not spawning in because I woke too many up. We'll get some killed then. Oh, now they're spawning in. Fuck. I'm just going. We're just going. Come on, open. Shit. We gotta bust this out. Oh, wrong tool. Shit. This way. Uh, this way. Okay. Out the window. Wait, I got an infection and it's healing itself? How, how is that possible? Is that D's doing? No. Oh, wait. I think I put... Uh, I think I did put antibiotics in, in D's inventory. So, she can give you antibiotics like that? That's pretty cool. Didn't know that. I mean, that's got to be what happened. Mm, they're dropping down on me. I really wanted to get inside that shotgun crate, but that ain't happening. Okay. This way. Holy fuck. Well, the supplies are still above us. Oh, stand up, lady. I wanted to see if I could shoot down on... ...some of these zombies. Oh, they went a different way. All right, fuck it. We gotta go here, and none of these zombies are spawning in. They're all below us. We could probably go right to the supplies and the main loot without having to deal with any more zombies. And none here either. Too bad this wasn't just the fetch quest. <laughs> then it would be easy. Oh! Spoke too soon. Holy shit. 
I don't know where they came from. I think they worked their way up here. I don't think they all just woke up. Anyway, we gotta go this way. And back in here. Look at all these guys. Let's take advantage of the barbed wire here. Get some kills. Ah, the rooftop. This is gonna be fun. Oh! They're spawning in up here. That's probably because all the zombies I just killed made room for more to spawn. Uh, we gotta go through here. Close that. And I think the supplies are right over there. Yep. Right, uh, around back. Let's pop this open. Bam! Got the supplies. Hour 11, almost. That's not bad. <laughs> if this was, like I said, just a fetch quest, we would have crushed it. But now, unfortunately, we gotta go kill all the fucking zombies, and I don't know how we're gonna make that happen. Because we still need to push forward towards the main loop. And clear all those zombies. I think that's the move, right? We should just push towards the end of the POI. Grab the main stash, because why not? I mean... I could use more ammo. Hopefully there is some there. And then I guess we'll work our way backwards. And then if it gets to be, you know, hour 17 or hour 18, we gotta just leave. Let's make a little stand right here, though. Oh, they're coming up the hatch. Get the fuck out of here, big boy. Okay, hatch is closed. Let's make a couple of frames. And let's put one... Well, we gotta put one there, I guess. Slow him down for a second. This is gonna be fun. Come on, hurry up. Are they even attacking the door? No, they're attacking the fucking wall. Whatever. What? Holy shit! Damn! They erupted out of there! That was like putting Mentos in a soda bottle. Okay, we gotta get through this door. Oh my god. Alright. Alright, well, fuck it. Uh, close the door. That worked out. Let's try that again. Good times. I hope all these zombies don't just respawn on our way back down. And all these kills are for nothing. Mm. Fuck you. Oh boy. They just keep coming. Shit. Oh, he was, like, stuck there for a second. Yeah, look at him trying to get around this, like, this corner here. They can't corner well. Uh-oh. It's getting out of control. I don't know how many more there are. Fuck off, big mama. Huh. Not so bad. I think a couple got stuck, like this guy. I'm prepared, D. Oh, shit. Thank you. Um, I kind of want to... I kind of want to go back through here and see what's going on. Just have a look. Oop, get up! Okay, got a couple of zombies down here. And we got a couple of loot bags. Oh, I gotta repair this. Shit. That was my one and only repair kit that I brought. Dead. Let's check these loot bags out. Nine millimeter! And a coffee. Oh, that was a good grab. And nothing there. All right. Let's keep moving. Oh, shit. Fucking die. Now they're all waking up. Oh, boy. Okay. Let's go down here through this door. 
Oh, shit. You know what, D? I agree with you this time. I, too, have a bad feeling about this. Close that door. Oh, my God. This is going to be bad. All right. Uh, you know what? Let's actually get up here. Close that door. Let's put the standard 9mm into the SMG. We'll get some kills at this door. And then we'll get to high ground, and we'll be fine. Okay. Not bad. Dead? Yes, that was actually pretty fucking good. Alright, we gotta jump across to there. There's a bird. Dead? No, oh, stupid. I can't... <laughs> I got parkour leveled up and I still can't make that fucking jump. Let's try that again. Nope. Mm. Nope, nope, nope. There we go. Oh, fuck off, bird. Okay. Take care of this guy. Oh, loot bag. Yep, I want that. Nine millimeter. Oh, that was a good decision. Fuck out of here, lady. All right, let's go get the main loot. And then we'll work our way back down the building. Killing uh, all the zombies. Oh, give me a break. And maybe we can actually pull this off. It's hour 13. I don't want to stay here any longer than, say, hour 18. I do have all my gear in a crate, so it won't take me long to gear up for the horde, but I still do not want to be rushing. I'm going to take this ammo just in case there's a gun that I can use in here that fires either 7.62 or um, Magnum rounds. That doesn't help. I'll take the shotgun shells just in case. That doesn't help. That doesn't help. Let's see what we got in here. Ooh, lots of ammo. None we can use, though. I'll take the first aid kits. But other than that, there's nothing, nothing I can use. I'm going to take the ammo just out of principle, though. Fuck it. All right. Let's work our way back down and see if we can manage to clear the area. It's going to be quite the challenge. There's definitely a group in this area. There we go. There's some out here. Come on, fellas. Nice, nice, nice. All right. That's good. Let's uh, check down here real quick. Oh, that's clear. Oh. Oh, fuck. We're getting... We're getting respawns. Mm. Get out of here. Oh, my God. This, uh... This was kind of my fear that... All the zombies we already killed are going to now respawn as we work our way back down the POI. Where is that one? Is that up here or down here? I don't even know. I see it on the compass, though. Here it is. Bam! Bop! Dead. Shit. This is such a mess. Yep. These are all fucking spawning in now. I don't know. I'm not not feeling super confident that we're going to get this done. Hey, at least we're having a good time now, right? That's all that matters is that we're having fun. Oh, we got more coming. All right. Let's uh, see if we can bottleneck them at a door like this one. Oh, you're not dead. No, you are. Here we go. 
Alright, not so bad. I thought there were more than that. And that's all the ammo. <laughs> Alright. We're we gonna be able to kill the rest of the zombies with just this club? I doubt it. I mean, we could if we had all night. But we don't. We gotta get the hell out of here soon. It's a gun safe. We gotta go for it. See if we can find some more 9mm. Hold on. Here we go. Shit. Come on! Loot bag! Oh, there we go! Some more 9mm and another coffee. That's nice. Some more ammo now. Fuck off, bird. Holy shit. They're all part of the POI. God damn it. Oh, did we just get a concussion? Nope. Temporary. It's a temporary concussion. Here we go. <laughs> a bunch of Rice Krispies. Come get it, fuckers. We're almost at the beginning. And then my hope is when we get to the beginning, kill the zombies that are down there, that will clear the area. If it doesn't, then we're just leaving. So I'm not going back through this building again. Shit. Gun needs repair, and I don't have a repair kit. So even though we have the ammo, can't use the gun. I guess I should have taken that level 6 SMG we, that we found with the main loot instead of leaving it behind. Come on, be the last zombie. Nope. I mean, I still see one on the compass. Where is it? In the bathroom? Yep. Fucking Kenny. Can he please be the last zombie? It would really mean a lot to me. Nope. Alright, well. We're getting close. No zombies in here. There's one over he Where? Here he is. Okay. Still not clear. No zombies here. No zombies in here. Shit. Maybe in the lobby? These are the, these are the last two zombies left. No. Shit. Well, it's hour 17. I am not going back through that building. So we're just going to have to leave. And, uh... Take the L. Fuck it. That was fun. We gave it a shot. I thought my tactic would, uh, would work. Because the way I saw it is if we went room by room, killing all the zombies as we go, we were never going to get it done in time. We were never going to reach the end in time. So I thought... By just running through, waking them all up, grabbing the supplies, and then trying to kill them all, I thought that would save time. But it just got all screwed up. And there were fucking zombies everywhere, and some were respawning. It was a mess. So that's not the best strategy to get, get it done. Uh, anyway, let's get home, get geared up, and see how this horde works out. Hopefully better than that POI did. All right, here we go. Day 7,000 horde in the G-spot. Let's do this shit. 
You know, I had someone say that I forgot to upgrade my hatches, but I didn't forget. That's by design. I want the hatches to be iron like this, and then I just upgrade them as they, or repair them as they take damage. Uh, because I felt that if I kept upgrading these hatches, the vault hatches, and then further and further, it might throw off the zombie path, you know? If the hatches have too many hit points, they might decide to just beat on the house or whatever. So, you gotta leave them iron. If that's where you want the zombies to come to, if you want them to come to the hatches, upgrading them further is not the best idea, in my opinion. Take this recog, and go to work. There's a demolisher. Oh, smoked them. And that's what we gotta do. We just gotta unload on those fucks and try and kill them before they explode. Because there's no controlling the junkies. The junkies can set off the demolisher's button. So we just gotta be vigilant and try and take them out as quick as possible. And so far, so good. I mean, look at this. This is pretty fucking metal, isn't it? Just in between two junkies going off. Let's get some pipe bombs out there. Knock them on their ass for a minute. Nice. Nice. Repair that. That's fun. I didn't bring too many of those, so I'm going to hold off on continuing to use those. We'll save them in case we end up running around on foot. I mean, the base will have to fail for that to happen, and... Honestly, Phase 1 is doing quite well. And... I really do think if, uh... If I just started going off with throwables and just stayed up on repairing these hatches, that we're not going to have any issues keeping them in phase one. But I'm going to let them come into this room here because I want to see uh, how this room does. And I want to see how the whole base does. You know, I don't want to just keep them at the front door. That's boring. So... We relax, D. Okay, I know what I'm doing. Sort of. There it is. They are through. And the dart traps in this room are going off. There's a lot of them in there. It's crazy. Oh, get out of here, you little bastard. Fucking skinny Pete. Trying to make his way through. That guy can fit through anything. Cop like to try and keep anything from blowing up in there. Ooh, took that demolisher's head right off. It's working out pretty good. And all I've been using, really, is the SMG. It's my favorite gun right now. With the fucking recog working and the fire rate, this thing is a beast. I don't know why I still have the silencer on it. Probably should have replaced that with maybe the long barrel. Give it a little more damage. This site is such a piece of shit. I thought it looked cool. It's terrible. You can hardly see anything. There goes that cop. He didn't trigger that demolisher, though. Oh, shit. Not good. We're okay. Oh, fuck. Two in a row is not that great. I don't want the floor to start to give out in there. That would be a really big problem, so... I'm gonna turn that blade trap on. And we're gonna move on to phase two. Let's get these junkies repaired. Definitely, uh, make use of them again. Oh, boy. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. <laughs> that escalated quickly. Are, are they still stuck there? I don't know. I'm turning this on, though. Yes. Oh, they're getting shocked. What's going on, though? Why am I not getting rushed right now? Oh! Stupid ass. God. I've done more damage to myself. Why are they not coming through here? Is it... Oh! I bet you it's because this... 
this lump of stone right here, whatever that is. Okay. Did that fix the problem? I think it did. Yep. Okay. Pop those up. Let's turn that on. Get back to work. Come on, zombies. I don't like this. There should be way more. Are oh, they coming? Are they coming? I think so. I think a lot of them were headed back up the stairs. To maybe beat through the house, and that's not what we want to see happen. We're looking all right, though, right now, I think. If we clear these zombies out and we're not getting more, then we'll go investigate. But if, as long as they keep coming, then I think we're fine. Oh, shit! No! The battery bank got destroyed! Fuck! What a stupid place to put a battery bank! Oh, man, I fucked up. I fucked up real good. That sucks. Phase 2 just took a shit. There we go. Gotta fucking bounce grenades off that wall there. I gotta take a look. Alright. The hatches are... Doing alright, I guess. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. See ya. Pop those up. Alright, we gotta turn these electrical wires on with this. Oh, shit. It's, that was connected to the battery bank that got destroyed. Fuck, man. Phase two is a flop. I screwed up. I put the battery bank in a stupid location. I think it was a cop that blew up and fucking destroyed it. Well, we got problems. I definitely thought phase two was gonna work a lot better than this. Get out of here. I don't know how you even got fucking out there. Holy shit. All right, we're about to see how the blade trap room works. Yep. Oh, that's fun. That is fun, but they are going to break through those hatches. Let's let the junkies get some work right here. There we go. Got to reload this guy. Bam. Oh, boy. Holy shit. I'm gonna just leave the junkies here. This is their final stand. Come on, take the recog. At least the zombies are continuing to push in this direction, and they're not, you know, deciding to attack the house or try and get to me some other way. So that, that's working. Let's get over here. Turn on the blade traps. Get out of the way, D. Come on, I want to see what is going on here. You're in my way. Should we just pick her up? Oh, I... All right. I don't want to pick her up, actually. <laughs> I want her to continue to heal me. All right. They're getting chopped at the door, and once they break through those hatches, then they're really in for some chopping. Here we go. Oh, it's beautiful. It's so beautiful. I know my shooting is going to damage this blade trap, but I don't care. Holy shit. Crazy. They just keep on coming. Yes. That demolisher got laid out. Doing pretty well. Doing pretty damn well. This is like the fucking 
choppity chop Olympics right here. So crazy. Oop. Really? You still got a bad feeling, Day? We're gonna be fine. Demolishers are still spawning in, so that's fun. Oh no. Oh no. That's not good. Maybe we should put these spikes in. Um, so what I'm gonna do... Oh, shit. Get out of here. Uh, I didn't take the time to go through and knock out the complete second row of spikes here. I decided I'm just gonna put in, um, one row of spikes. I won't go too high with the spikes that I'm going to install, and then that should be the route they take. And that'll kind of bottleneck them, and then we can shoot the shit out of them. So, that's what I'm gonna do. In a second. Let me get some throwable action here. Oh! A little too close. Alright. So yeah, I'm just gonna put in the spikes like this. And this, like I said, is the path they should take now. And, uh, hopefully that's, that's how it works. Cause then, we've got a long straightaway right here. Where we can just shoot the fuck out of them. And they're in the room, and they are actually going for the spikes that are too high. Look, they're just pushing their way through. <laughs> Damn. I always think I know what they're gonna do, and then they always do the opposite. I can't see shit. I'm just shooting into the fucking void with that stupid sight. Alright. Pop that up. Turn that on. And we wait. Oh, the... The fucking spikes are blocking the trigger plate. I shouldn't have put those spikes in. That was a mistake. Let's see, I could... I could probably remove them with the steel club. If I could... get a hit on them. There we go. Okay. Oh, I'm getting hit. But I gotta get rid of these fucking things. Shit. There we go. All right, now they're getting shot. Man, can't believe we're at this phase of the base already. Hour three, we got one hour until morning. We may end up running around on foot upstairs. Watch out for those darts. <laughs> oh boy. I wanna shoot them as they're coming down this hallway though. Oh, getting shot. I gotta step off the trigger plate there. It's working out. It really is. So far, everything has worked the way I envisioned it. If only I would have put that battery bank in a different location. We'd still probably be hanging out in phase two right now. We still may be hanging out in phase one if I didn't fucking let him through. But I wanted to test out the whole base, you know? I didn't want to just fucking shut him down right there. Here we go. Now they're starting to pile up. Mm, getting shot. I know that's not it. So where are they at? Got to turn these blade traps off. Nothing I can use. What is that sound? Oh, that's the junkies. Junkies are still going off. Yeah, one there's one one of them is. The other one got destroyed and here comes a whole group. Okay, getting a little crazy. Let's get back over here. It's like a whole new wave coming. Pop that up. It's officially morning. I think all we got left is some stragglers. Maybe not. I wonder if there's a screamer somewhere spawning in more. 
Holy shit. Definitely more left than I thought. Nope. Get out of here. Come on. All right, he's dead. Oh, shit, they broke through. Well, on to the uh, final stand here. I think this is just about it. All we got is maybe a few stragglers caught in different areas of the base. Let's run these two up the ladder here. See what's going on. There is possibly a screamer up here. I haven't heard one, though, so... Maybe not. Oh, front door is missing. So they did come in the house. Oh, shit. Look. Look at this. I wonder... Did zombies do that, or did structural integrity do that? I don't know. I'm assuming zombies, because the front door is gone. Where are those other two zombies? They didn't follow me up the ladder. Yeah, putting a battery bank right there where we were going to be doing all the fighting was possibly the dumbest thing I've ever done <laughs> in terms of base building. But shit, other than that... This is definitely one of the, my favorite bases I've ever built. And it did damn well against the Day 7000 Horde. Matter of fact, I think we could have ended this shit in Phase 1, you know? If, we if I would have just went balls to the wall with throwables and the fucking rocket launcher and just let them have it nonstop in Phase 1, they probably never would have got past that shit. But... I had to let him through, because I wanted to see how Phase 2 was going to do, and I wanted to see the Blade Trap Room uh, in action, and I wanted to see how the Spiked Room was going to do. But anyway, that was fun. I enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I can't thank you all enough for all of the support you've shown me on this series, and frankly, all of the support you show me on every series. You guys are the best. I can't do it without you, so thank you so much. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you're looking forward to the next one. You guys can follow me on Instagram or Twitter if you want. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. Stick around for more Grounded, more Conan, and a new 7 Days to Die series coming up real soon. And I will catch you guys in the next one.